Documents reveal BP lobbied to open up two protected areas in the Alaskan Arctic for oil drilling. The Beaufort Sea and the Arctic Refuge. The Arctic Refuge is sacred to the indigenous Gwich'in people. One of the last untouched ecosystems on Earth, it has been in the oil industry's crosshairs for decades. We've been trying to, to open the 1002 area for close to 40 years now. Trump's 2017 tax bill ordered the Interior Department to start selling licenses to drill in the Arctic Refuge. This is good for Alaska, but more importantly, it's good for the country. Our investigation reveals that BP backed this move, despite the fact that any investment in new oil and gas fields is incompatible with limiting global warming to 1.5 degrees. Alaska won a big policy victory when the federal government opened the door to oil and gas development and the Arctic National Wildlife Refuge. We, so, good crowd. we discovered that a BP-funded industry lobby group spent thousands of dollars on Facebook ads, which did not mention their big oil sponsors. The ads targeted Trump supporters on behalf of a front group called Energy Citizens, claiming oil drilling in the Arctic Refuge would have, quote, minimal environmental impact. In 2017, BP lobbied officials in Washington on Arctic oil, just weeks before the Trump administration repealed an Obama-era ban on offshore drilling in the Alaskan Arctic. BP later wrote to administration officials welcoming the new access in the Beaufort Sea. This is part of a wider pattern of behaviour by BP, pushing back against climate change regulations. This year, we also revealed that BP successfully lobbied to roll back regulations that were key for the US to meet its Paris climate commitments. 